So we name this the reading of x-intercepts from any line, for instance, minus 3x plus 4y plus 29. And the reason it's called reading is that you should be able to just calculate by making the y value 0 to get the x-intercept. So you're going to make the y value 0 so you can read literally 28 over negative 3, or negative 28 over 3. Now watch out, we're looking for the y-intercept this time. So we can read that this would become 67 when you brought it across over 23. Okay, my suggestion is you'd get up to 10 correct to build your confidence. Now we're looking for an x-intercept, dividing by the y, and negating this because it's the wrong side, negative 53 over 13. Oh, that's that wrong. Should have been over 3. So y intercept x is 0. So of course when you think about it you want to divide by the number in front of y. So y intercept divide negative 13 by 4. x intercept divide negative 14 by 5. So another way of looking at it as well as saying for the x intercept you cover up the y value, you can also just think about it as for the x intercept you divide the far side by the x coefficient of 5, giving you minus 14 over 5. For x intercept 10 minus 10 over 1, minus 10 over 1. For y intercept 0. X intercept so minus 22 but then minus 22 over minus 3 is 22 over 3. Let's just have a look at the hint facility we incorporated into this. So it just tells you what to substitute in. But what you can do is think of the other when you're looking for y intercept, just think of the other term has gone away, the x term has gone away. 45 over 40. Okay, that's the score of 10. Thanks for watching.